can the State Department have no record of my birth? That's just wrong. I mean, I had a copy of my birth certificate until I lost it. Oh, this is a bureaucratic nightmare. Okay, let's just let's just hope my mom can find her copy so I don't have to prove that I was born in the U.S. What? No, I just... Look, Harmony's been putting you off about your birth certificate. I mean, could it be that she just doesn't have it? You mean, could it be more than a clerical error? My mom's hiding something about my birth. Maybe that's why she's been so evasive. So she's been lying to me this whole time. Not to sound distrusting, but I knew there was something that you weren't telling me. I'm sorry I kept this secret for my daughter's entire life, so uh, it's hard to just come out and say it. This is a safe place. Harmony, you can talk to me. The reason why I can't tell Willow that I forged the birth certificate is because... Her mother. She didn't pick up, but I guess I'll just have to track her down after class. Hey, look, Paris isn't going anywhere. There'll be other trips. I know, I know, and honestly, this isn't even about the passport anymore. I think you're right. I think my mom's been keeping something from me. Uh, but I can't dwell on that right now. I have to get to the hospital. Don't want to be late. I love you. I love you too. And we'll get to the bottom of this, okay? Okay. Promise. Okay. Why don't you start from the beginning? Uh, okay. But Douglas and I uh, used to live on a commune in Colorado. Right, I knew that. Yeah. It was called Friends of Peace and Love. It was led by the prophet Josiah. Um... This pregnant woman named Joan joined our community, and she and I became friends. And about a week after she gave birth, I woke up one morning and Joan was gone. So she left the baby there. Josiah said that God wanted Douglas and me to raise the little girl as our own. And so you did. Who was I to question God? Something wrong with Wiley? 